All right. Welcome to Lucky Day 13 of the Flobathon Subathon for your April 13th, 2024. Got some subs in the tubs and gift subs. We're up to 15 hours, 55 minutes on the timer, which resumes... Math! Math, you figured it out, Mimatsky. You figured it out. Now it is 15 hours, 55 minutes, and 51 seconds. A palindrome! Not anymore. The timer resumes. We left off at 59,770.5 megabytes. Creeping up towards that 60 gigabyte mark. If you've got your woofs ready, I think I'm ready to continue. Woof! There we go. That wasn't so bad. Unlike previous. Oh, that scared me. <laughs> oh, oh, yes. Kurt Wolfie. Magical Blob, 63 months in the sub tub. <laughs> that 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 is an alarming alert. And a hype train. Ah oh, jeez. Ah jeez. A hype train we're taking the hype train to the far lands. Ah, cheese. Flob, flob brand cheese, pasteurized cheese product. <laughs> Hype train. I'm not, however, seeing the hype train on my chat, so I have no idea <laughs> what's happening with it. <laughs> it's there. No? Is it? <laughs> Is it actually there? Hold on, let me refresh chat. Refresh chat, rather. Oh, here we go. I see the subathon. The subathon alert. You have to view. You have to choose which thing to view, which is very nice. That's weird. <laughs> there we go. 86% with three minutes remaining in the hype train. Here it comes again. 51. After I walked Juno, I went to a Wilco Farm store. Because I had a coupon for a free bucket. <laughs> Gotta go get that free bucket. And also like a 40% off coupon. And also they had potting soil. A five gallon bucket, yeah. Is there any other bucket <laughs> for free? I did that, and I took. I I didn't realize, but I I looked at the the chicks. They have chick chicks there, like animals, like the birds, various chicks of chickens and ducks and other things. For it is 
a farm store. Could have been like a car washing bucket. It is a car washing bucket. Now that I have it, I can use it however I please. And I also got bird seed for 40% off. Did I mention that already? The bird feeder's got to go back out. It's like, I don't know if anybody's ever shopped at one of these places. It's kind of like weirder there. As opposed to like a Home Depot or like a garden store. Like when you buy your big bags of dirt, they give you like, there's a loading zone that they give you a ticket and then the kids in the loading zone, which is my favorite comedy troupe. Whoa. Like load your bags of dirt for you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's kind of weird. I can see if we're like big, but I just get three bags. I just got three bags. Three bags of dirt. You missed the train. Ooh. Well, yeah, that was the day. But then I also, uh, before I went, I mistakenly, I started fiddling with the truck, tightening some bolts to hopefully stop it from leaking oil. But then I noted a bolt missing, a st the whole stud missing from the exhaust manifolds. So I like started to try to take off the heat shields and it started to get out of control <laughs> and I'm like wait a minute let's maybe let's not oh okay bye whoa Wolfie almost pushed me down there that's a shame Well, I found it. I think it, I'm, I'm not sure what the deal is. It's either stripped, either the bolt is stripped or the hole is stripped. Either way, not good. But I ended up getting one of my, my one of those like magnets to grab it, but then the magnet got stuck. <laughs> So I had to get like a pry bar to like pry the heat shield away because I couldn't fully remove the heat shield because for whatever reason it's like bolted down with eight bolts all on top and on bottom. So yeah, I decided this is taking much. I this is going to turn into a, a sad day if I like end up taking the heat shield off and then the exhaust manifold like crumbles in half and falls off and then I can't go to get my free bucket. I mean I've I've known there's been an exhaust leak and these these are just the cast exhaust manifolds that tend to crack and split over the 30 years. 30 plus years they've been around. 31 years. Did you see other people carrying their free buckets? No, I went, I had the coupon. And like the lady at the cash register is like, oh, I see they've started to send these out. So I guess she's not. She's like, I've had a few so far. 
Like, they just have, like, a promo thing that went out in the mail. So it must just be, like, a seasonal thing to get people into the shop, or into the store. But no, I didn't, I didn't see anybody else with their buckets. No, it's just come in and get a free bucket with any purchase, was the coupon. And I'm like, don't mind if I do. <laughs> but also, I did need bird seed and potting soil. So yeah, that's, 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 that was my day. <laughs> that was my day. And then I got home. And I remember the conversation we had after I shaved my head about how hard it is for me to do it. And it was exacerbated by the fact that I like wait a week or two between times I shaved my head. So I shaved it days, mere days after I last shaved it. It went, it went better, smoother. Still, it's still time consuming. Uh, oh. I have an idea. It's gonna work great. Oh, it didn't work great. Wolfie still took damage. Wolfie, oh my god. Okay. <laughs> What is taking up all my inventory space? I guess the three boats. The six pork chops. The five pork chops. I mean, we opened up a, a, an inventory space by making this butter hat. Use Harden. Oh, this has bad news written all over it. Oh, I knew it. <laughs> How about everybody else? How has your Saturday been going or been gone? What are the plans of the Datsun or has it been taunting you in the garage? Taunt. Mostly taunting. I just need... I... <laughs> 
I would if I need if I if I did that I would not stream. <laughs> I would have to miss a day of streaming. And right now. I must stream. <laughs> or it is the subathon. Those guys up there. They got their own little own little plateau. I have the stuff. I now need to I have the replacement and now need to replace the ball joints. Which are the very things we were trying not to have to replace. So that is yet another setback, but it might make the actual job easier, not having to try to do everything while the strut is still attached to the car. But yeah, it is not, I've not done one thing to it since the end of the last stream we were working on the car. Not a single thing. But I've also been like planting stuff and mowing the lawn and Focused on that sort of thing. Spreading seeds. <laughs> it's just too much stuff. You are fully dilated to 10 centimeters. You may now give birth. Sub baby! Wildcard84, thank you for nine months in the sub tub. With that Twitch Prime, much appreciated. Sub tub, I think that was our first Star Trek. Star Trek. <laughs> Star Trek. Star Trek. Ah, that, that's a t shirt idea. Write that down in like the Star Trek font. Uh, <laughs> Star Trek alert that we ever had was that one. And then it all cascaded from there. I still need to make these alerts. We're watching episodes and I keep taking notes on where I can make alerts and I... I, I have to go back and do it. It's such a laborious process. Gotta log into the Paramount Plus here on the computer and then like go to the episode and then it plays a series of ads before you can start watching and then when I scroll or fast forward to the section where the alert is it plays another set of ads I gotta sit through. The, the sort of stuff and and the time I spend to make this an enjoyable streaming experience, you have no idea. Alright, careful, Wolfie. Oh! Ha <laughs> ha! Uh, okay. He deflected off of me. I don't know if you, like, realized that. That was pretty good. And a gift sub! Much appreciated. The Twitch sub is for you and the gift sub is for someone else.
bring in four minutes to the timer. Wild card, thank you very much. Bezos bought mine? Well, technically you bought yours. <laughs> You gave the money to Bezos, and now you're telling Bezos to give a fraction of that money to me. This month. You have to repeatedly come back and do that every month. <laughs> Spoiters? Spooky blowy noises. Indeed. Ignoring noises. Sorry, I'm tea time. Bye to you too, sirs. Does your vision stutter like this in your dreams? <laughs> that would that would be something. That would be a severe medical condition. Levitating islands. Have you ever had a Minecraft dream before? I don't... I mean, yes, I guess. But it was always like... It was weirdly in the context of like... Streaming or making YouTube or something like that. But also not like a dream where I was like sitting here playing the game. It's like I, I was in the game. I 
I don't think I ever have dreams that I'm playing a video game. I have dreams that I'm playing a video game, but like from within. <laughs> like not, like there's no there's no screen. Yeah, it's almost it is like a mix. It's hard to it's hard to explain, I guess. That's why it's a dream. Like, I've had far lands or bust dreams, but, like, I end up finding a bunch of, like, giant buildings and, like, pyramids and stuff, and then it turns kind of Tomb Raider-y, and there's, like, stuff to explore and, like, bosses to battle and whatever, and I'm kind of like, I don't know how people are going to believe that this is still far lands or bust. <laughs> it's like that sort of thing. That's kind of what they're doing with modern Minecraft. Oh no. in there. <laughs> Woof. Oh, I think that's lava. I'm going to go this way.
So. Ah. That is fine. Just in case. Oh. I guess that was kind of dangerous to do on the sand. <laughs> Safety first. Excuse me. steps oh dang it <laughs> love to backtrack Anybody remember the red power mod? Mod? What's a mod? Buddy. Oh. I just picked up all those sticks I threw. Everybody's talking about modern Minecraft in chat. And I cannot relate. Cheaty snow. We got cheaty snowed.
What happened there? Did Wolfie break the boat? He did. <laughs> we need a sub goal for Kurt to play modern Minecraft. Kerbal Space Program 2 is a sub goal. That is not. So, what's up? I can go several days without rest if necessary. You cannot. Bath bomb! Smidge, thank you for the five subs in the tub. Ten minutes back on the timer, thank you very much. Have you started watching Fallout on Amazon Prime? No. No, I have not. I don't... I've never played Fallout. And I also don't really... Amazon Prime. I mean, the girlfriend has it, so, like, we could watch stuff on there, but... There really isn't much. I mean, we've, whoa, we've been watching the, uh, new, the new and last season of Discovery. I'm kind of, uh, on it. <laughs> How about the Halo show, though, am I right? That got season two going. Look at this. It's like a facade.
Oh, Wolfie. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> we have fun here. <laughs> Cliff diving. Alright, Wolfie, go this way. Don't hurt yourself. Sinkhole. Oh man, we did start, speaking of watching stuff, we did start watching uh, rock, rock collecting YouTube yesterday. <laughs> and like, rock tumbling YouTube. So that's what my suggested feed is going to be inundated with from now on. Rock tumbling always seems fun, but then you have to realize that it, like, takes a month <laughs> or whatever. We didn't even watch anything about the tumbling part. We just watched these people on a, the, on a waterfront looking, looking at rocks, picking up rocks and looking at them, saying, oh, this is neat, and then being like, but I ain't going to keep it and throwing it back. <laughs> What takes longer, rock tumbling or wood drawing? Is wood drawing a hobby? If you want it to be. Part of woodworking. Yes. Well, the girlfriend came home with recently milled wood on account of the wood mill she was learning to use. Got a big round, like a big cookie flat section of a trunk. Yes, and people are like... Much, much like in that, we what we truthfully apparently learned in Lumberjack Dynasty. You got to sleep comfortable bed for like four weeks, and that's that's if your wood is in a dryer, a wood dryer. We don't have a wood dryer.
But yeah, I don't know. I think I'm just going to make... I mean, I, I... The girlfriend does want to try to make a table out of that big, flat round. Um, and I'll try to make, like, a cutting board or something. But yeah, I guess I don't know what what's the... <laughs> If if you do work your wood <laughs> before it's dry, like what happens? It splits or something as it dries. Warps. I'll just maybe I'll just never let it get dry. It's wet wood. I mean, that doesn't help anything with apparently the the wood that made a wooden fence. That stuff sags and warps. All over the place. Although the girlfriend recently noted that it's now it's now finally that time of year where the gate the fence gates can be opened and closed with a latch <laughs> as opposed to the cold and rainy parts of the year where they cannot be. <laughs> In, in spite of my efforts with the steel cable braces, Thought about using a boat, but I'm going to use this land instead, and my feet on the land. Oh god, I also ended up on, probably in a related suggestion, on, on woodworking YouTube. Build this planter box for only six dollars. Easily turn a profit with your woodworking skills. It just takes three fence posts. And then turns out there's like 6,000 of the same video by all these different channels. Only costs $3 profit from your woodworking. I'm like, ha, I made mine out of broken pieces of my fence. <laughs> and I didn't have any plans. 
or a wood shop with a table saw. Yeah, they say for only six dollars, but they're not counting their forty-five thousand dollar wood shop equipment. Table saws and miter saws and jigs. Jigs! Probably hit that cow. He's like, what the heck? Where'd that come from? the game. I made tea already. Thank you, though. Dang it! He was gonna make me tea! Yeah. Not much. Are you rested? Like, Not no, at all. Feel... Time to mic up! Hold on. <laughs> okay, hold on. I gotta mic up. There, they can hear down. you now. Hold on, I can't be standing up. I just gotta sit down. I'm, I'm, Pull up a chair. I'm pulling one up a far away. It's the girlfriend's home podcast. Oh God! <laughs> oh, I thought that. I thought your foot was Juno. <laughs> uh, <laughs> this is how they sit when they podcast. Yes, it is. This is a radio sit. They can't see, but. My feet's on the Kurt desk. Your foot's on Near the Kurt it. desk. T now it is. But I don't want to jostle mm. anything. Can, can you hear her morning morning voice? It's my it's my late afternoon. Do I sound weird? You do. You sound like you took a nap, <laughs> which oh. is what happened. Two naps a year. Keeps the mind clear. See? A little bit. They notice. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I do. <laughs> <laughs> I'm all skied out. I was just real scheming today. A real last day of scheming. Yeah, I'm kicking myself that I didn't put on a funny costume. So, but we watched um, uh, a pond, pond skimming or, oh my God, what the hell is it called? Yeah, the pond skim. The po pond skim? Pond skimming. Is that what it's called? Yep. I can't read. Oh, yeah, you're not going to be able to. That's fine. Don't Ponzi worry. scheme, yes. Ponzi, Ponzi scheming. No, I know all about that, too. But uh, that's for another podcast. Um, yeah, pond skimming. It was pretty sweet. I could do it, definitely. I will do it next year. Oh, gosh. I'm definitely doing it. The problem is they charge for it. I would have did it that day. Oh. but Yeah. You probably got to sign a waiver. Oh yeah, I I'm telling you, I saw a guy's spinal cord basically ripped off of his own body. Like he ain't right. He and it, when we left, an ambulance was going towards there. So I'm like, mm, bummer. Maybe fine. I'm not gonna go 150 percent for speed and the jump. I'm going for a f funny costume and sink into the water. Mm. You're going. You're going at sinking speed. Yeah. Not skimming speed. Yeah. For those of you who don't know, that's where when you when at the bottom of a ski hill they, they have a pond, a pool of water that if you're going fast enough you can ski across the water. Mm-hmm. And I'd say it's fifty fifty. It's fifty fifty. Half of them make it, half of them don't. And this one had a really treacherous lip at the end of the pond that was like launching people like twenty feet in the air. 
Google it. L look for it on YouTube, and then yeah. you'll start to get all the recommendations. Yeah. And soon it'll, you'll become a scheming like me. Mm. Just like one day Kurt will be. I did. So I went to turn to look at somebody I was ski with, and I did try to cross over like I was on roller skates. That was funny. I didn't fall. I just. I probably just from far away, I looked like an idiot. Like I didn't know what I was doing, but I'm like, well, I stood up, so I must know what I'm doing. So there's that. There's that. But yeah, I skied. Mm -hmm. I skied a whole lot. I didn't even look at my stats. Didn't look at your stats. Yeah, you gotta be at speed, but you don't have to be at... Some people were hitting it at least 50, 55 miles an hour, and that was what was launching them at the end, which was dangerous. Skiing is a notoriously a safe sport. It's fine if you learn by going with me. <laughs> you were fine when you mm -hmm. cross-country skied. So yeah, it was fun. That's it. I was all tuckered out. Too much sunshine for a golf like me. Mm -hmm. It was warm. I only had minimal black layers. Mm. It was fun. Good. Like, I am glad. Lots of long runs. But I already told you. Yeah. I've Old heard news. all these stories already. Old news. If you went under the water, would you get stuck under the ice? Yes. Oh. And Could you see before. through it up to the sky as you died? Like, <laughs> like would you have time to think? And be like, gunk, 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 like knocking on it? You can maybe break it. Things are difficult to break from underwater. <laughs> Test it out. <laughs> no. Here comes 15, 15, 15. Yay. Ooh. Oh, that was when I was watching. We were we were watching the uh, the live feeds of the solar eclipse. I forgot which location it was, but when like the sun came back, we heard somebody boo. <laughs> That's my favorite person. <laughs> Probably related to me. It's no 17, 17, 17. Oh, that's whose fault is that? Whose fault is that? Can you like crouch and crawl in this game? You can crouch like that. Okay, because I'm thinking yeah, it'd be funny to get under the ice, but only one block high and crouch and crawl and then just stand up and break it. <laughs> I guess you Why can... do you have a yellow hat? It's my butter hat. Why do you... Because I had leftover gold it's and your... my, my helmet broke. Your butter face. Oh, it's gold. It's a golden hat. Oh, I yes. thought it was actually butter. No, but that's what it's called. Now it, looks it looks like a golden like... apple hat. The golden apple hat. Gotta protect this apple. No one cares about these other versions. It's only this version. I don't know. This is just an idea. Mm-hmm. There you have it. There you have it. Well, I won't torture you for long. Oh, Your bananas. My bag of bananas. God damn, I cannot believe how many you've eaten of these. It you... doesn't look like I've eaten any at all. No, <laughs> that's almost gone. Have you just been every day putting one in the garbage can? <laughs> yes. <laughs> and a banana for you. Is that bamboo? Uh, no, they're technically called reeds in the game. Well, good. It looks a lot like bamboo. Although there is now bamboo in like the latest game. But this is how you get sugar. It's like sugar cane, I guess. Is what, it, what is it called? Which is sugar cane. And then you get sugar. And then. Do you protect the sugar? Can you make yes. a mound of sugar on uh, the ground? There. Now do you protect it or the bees? <laughs> bees. <laughs> I 
<laughs> well, they look like wolfy poops. Wolfy poops. <laughs> yes. Why are they floating? Because I dropped them. Can you feed the pigs with the sugar? You cannot feed sugar to pigs. I think you can't feed anything to pigs. According to the ads, in, uh, sugar is supposed to be brown. The ads? Yeah, like what ads? the just the ads in the store. You get your natural oh, raw sugar. Raw sugar. Yep. Brown. There you go. Yeah, I couldn't really sleep. So I'm tired. Oh, I thought you were sleeping. That's I was why I trying. Fed, I fed the cats. Oh, I appreciate it. Mm -hmm. Although I let Niblet out. Niblet's I got up to let him out. The old nibbler. Brown sugar just has some molasses in it. I don't know. That Did, person is... Add it, molasses to it? I'm just saying they sound like a bee. They They're sound beezies. like a bee. They're trying to commandeer our sugar stockpile. Bise. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> took this picture I was going to text it to you but oh, I didn't get your I know that's I right. never check I never hear it when you I'm don't... streaming that's that's why for I what's that they got they got babies did at... you take fistfuls of them no they said don't touch them oh yeah do you do you read every sign that you follow every sign that you see <laughs> do you read every sign that you follow it. So what he's not showing you is these beautiful, beautiful box of ducklings that he didn't touch and go. Bins, you can buy bin, baby ducklings, baby chickens, baby all sorts of fowls at the Wilco Farm Store. Come in and get your free bucket. Yeah, you and your buckets. I guess I, where's my bucket? Is it one per household? Probably. Well, I mean, I guess you could sign up for their rewards and they'll send you that coupon i think that's why i got there oh well i know a place that's got a whole lot of buckets that i could just drive up at night and grab them <laughs> hey, oh, yes. i see how it is maybe that is her bucket i mean i'm just saying now that we're married your bucket is my bucket <laughs> yes, we gotta split that bucket down the middle for tax purposes oh man what if no what if when we get a divorce give me half that bucket <laughs> 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 like I'm, was I'm when just, we get a divorce. I'm just out there torching it. <laughs> I would never, 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 never divorce you because I refuse to share the bucket. Mm. No, it goes in half the other way, not top half, bottom half. <laughs> uh, oh man, this can I just tell an an irrelevant story related to a bucket? It's just a short, funny one. Sure, bucket stories. It's a real funny bucket story. Um, <laughs> long ago, in a place far, far away from here, I had a friend who, whom their home was basically condemned. I would say that it was not a safe living condition, so we used to just do as we pleased. And one time we got a bucket, what it was, you know, like a free bucket. And I don't know why, this is when toilet paper was, you know, cheap and not hoarded the way it is now we just had just this wild hair to fill the bucket full of a couple rolls of toilet paper and in her kitchen which had no flooring thankfully uh it was just subfloor we set it on fire and we're like well that's not good so <laughs> wait we, you set so, it on fire yeah so it we caught on fire oh yeah yeah yeah, yeah decided yeah. to say that's not good so that we're like we, we did is not so good. we were like we got to get it out so we grabbed the handle to walk it outside and it melt because the fire was in the middle of it it actually mel melted so the top four inches of the bucket the full circle pulled off and it stretched out melted all over the floor we had to leave it 
we had to pour water on it. <laughs> and then you're so, like, gee, I wonder why your house is condemned. No, that wasn't, it was, trust me, it had nothing to do with what we were doing. <laughs> it had nothing to do with no. melting That's bucket. a whole other thing. It's a, It's. It's not, it, it's, it doesn't matter for the story. But I'm saying <laughs> it is actually kind of funny to see how easily a bucket just splits in half. But that's not the way I would split it. <laughs> you have experience. Yeah. So, yeah. I remember we laughed so hard when we were like, because it was like one of those things you're just laughing about as it's just falling apart. And we're like, what are we going to do? <laughs> so we never, we only ever got the bottom half out of the kitchen. We had to put water on it. Oh. It did stay in the sub four, but who cares about that? So yeah, it's not a great story. <laughs> that, is, that's, that is a bucket story, though. You never heard my bucket story. No, I've, that's the first time I've heard it. Well, we don't talk. We don't have a lot of bucket-heavy conversations. No. Need Somebody a, need a burning bucket emote now. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Somebody clipped that for the divorce proceedings. Never, <laughs> never. I will not break apart. The, the cats have this dad. They need him. They have this dad. You're precious. How dare they even use that word in our general... I, bet, but I can block that word in chat. Well, that'd be funny, actually. You ever just talk about blocking certain people's names just to see what would it... Like, if it just show up stars? I don't think you or can Or just do random that. words that don't make any sense. Like, is... <laughs> is no more no more using is i don't know i, I don't also know. don't think that's a, i don't think i could do that on twitch okay i think i could do that on well the thing is is if you block a word yeah. it'll block the whole message like oh. on youtube you can block words all right there we go there we have it block that bucket let's go to sleep and back up the world and see how uh, big it has become i'll wait for that and i'm out of here i'm gonna go get my learn on mm. Getting close, 59,841.2 megabytes. What are you trying to get to? Well, the far lands, but the 60, around 60,000 is apparently oh God, you're where almost they there. estimate the, the next jitter is going to happen. And it's going to yeah, be know. more shaky. So you can't do that in a day, though, can you? Are you going to blast it today? I and there's not enough hours left in the day. Oh, I don't know. I don't know what time is in Minecraft. I mean, just as far as like hours for me to be streaming. <laughs> That's what I mean too. Yes. Full full block jitter. Is that what it's gonna be? That well, no half block jitter. All right. In for segment two of day 13 of the Flabathon Subathon. Left off at 59,841.2 megabytes. We've raised $5,743.76 for direct relief. I did, I was doing the math uh, and I added a tab to the Subathon spreadsheet that tallies, is tallying our lifetime uh, donation amounts, fundraising amounts, and we surpassed four hundred and seventy-five thousand dollars. With the current number, we're at four hundred seventy-eight thousand six hundred and eighty-three dollars and sixty-eight cents raised for charities since twenty eleven. You know, you know what you gotta have ready for that. Your woofs. <laughs> Woof. Woof indeed. Grab Wolfie.
and continue west, I will be needing more dirt. That's probably enough. <laughs> oh, I left some... I don't even know how that happened. The floating points! Woo! Oh, don't fall down there, Wolfie. He's going around! What a pathfinder! Has Wolfie ever been too far away to hear? No! I suppose maybe... When we were, like, building the F3 monument, if we, like, say in, like, the Enterprise, if we slept in the bed in the Enterprise, I didn't bring Wolfie up there. Oh, well, maybe. But you could even hear him all the way back there. But in that case... I guess it's never it's never generally like the start of a segment or an episode or a stream, so we don't have to wait for him to bark. A uh, moody you too, sir. Or ma'am. Devil of a You want to shear the pigs? <laughs> is that not how bacon is made? Sorry, what? In other news, in other news, I left two custard horns and two creamed horns on the self-checkout scanner earlier today. I don't know what any of those are. The Eclipse. Oh, we're not in the path of totality. Oh, 
Careful, old face. Oh, gosh. Cream horns. Oh, so it's like a, it's like a, <laughs> what is, what is that called? A cross hall? But it's half filled with cream. Trombone, a cream-filled trombone. Imagine a lopsided cannoli. Now rotate that lopsided cannoli in your mind. Excuse me. I keep yawning now. It's been a while since I've baked anything, like other than bread, I guess. Speaking of which, I gotta do that. I'm out of bread. Bake a discount cake for only six dollars. Bake this cake and throw it in your wooden planter. There's a palindrome. Oh wait, no, that wasn't a palindrome. I that would have been 41. I guess I messed up. Never mind. I missed it. <laughs> some cakes that seemed like they would have baked as discount cakes. Yeah, I'm not very good at cakes. I always have much grander schemes. And then, I don't know if it's because I don't make my own frosting. I just buy the tub of frosting and then I try to, like, make do with that. Maybe I gotta go all in on the cake making. Who needs frosting? It's not a cake. 
without the frosting. That's what makes it a cake. It's just weird bread without it. <laughs> I mean, even that's what I use is the packaged cake mix. <laughs> it's just we don't really have, like, specific cake pans. We end up having to, like, make do with, like a brownie pan or, or like a springform pan. Cakes come in all different shapes. I know, but it's more of what? <laughs> okay. That's weird. I can't even get like a good picture of it. But I think it even comes down to, like, the material of the cake pan. Like, if it's non-stick, that changes the baking process. If it's a thicker metal. Or if it's not round, then it bakes unevenly. One of those endless pool situations. Infinite pools, I think you need. Is what you meant. <laughs> Infinite... Not, not even that. Infinity! pools. In every way, box-made cakes are better than scratch-made cakes. I think in every way, pre-made cakes, because <laughs> then you don't got to do nothing, and it's pre-made for you and decorated, and you just got to plop it down and slice into it, are better than all of the above. Infinity cake pan. Uh, it just seamlessly blends into another cake. Right, not a grocery store though. Although our wedding cake was grocery store, and that was alright. But like a professionally made cake. An Entenmann's, perhaps. <laughs> Yeah, they make, uh, there's, uh, I mean, Safeway, but other stores, I don't know where we found this one, I think it was Safeway, has a, has a strawberry cake, like layer cake that's gluten-free, and that's what we bought for, for our wedding day, and we ate awkwardly <laughs> together. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh, just to just to put the whole thing together. Well, it was just, it was kind of like. Well, first it was awkward because the 
the the the owner of the 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 bed and breakfast was like there cleaning up while we were in the kitchen doing our cake thing. So it was kind of like we were just trying to be funny and like do the wedding cake thing, but there was also a guy <laughs> off 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 screen. And then it's like kind of like yeah, this is kind of this the whole wedding cake, cutting the wedding cake and feeding it to each other is kind of more f for other people. Like it's kind of more for an actual event. So, that, that we just were like this is this is awkward. <laughs> But we did it anyway, and it's now part of the story. The lore, if you will. Did Juno get cake? Juno did not get cake. I've gotten her dog cupcakes in the past, and the last time I did, she like shoved the whole thing in her mouth, and it was like so dry that she couldn't swallow it, so she started like choking on it, like. Oh. <laughs> so that was like the last time we went for the doggy cake. always cut it up but th then at what point am I just giving her treats <laughs> whoa no no double all right this place is just treacherous treacherous I say I think at every point, if you're giving her a cupcake. I know, but it, it, again, that's for the humans. Juno doesn't care that it's a cake. But she does care that it's like a big giant thing and she's going to get it all to herself. Which is what makes her go crazy. I think that what yeah, that what I actually, there was a box mix for dogs that I made so I made her cupcakes but they were so dry inside I don't I think we ended up throwing the rest of it away <laughs> I mean, just like we can't give her any sort of, like, I mean, you're not supposed to really, like, rawhide is pretty bad for a dog. But we'd get, like, the no, the fake rawhide, the digestible rawhide things, but, like, those, she still just tries to shove down her throat and, like, oh, it's like, no, dog is going to choke. There's no sense of self-preservation when it comes to food. Did you just eat the boat? Yeah, I'm choking on it. Oh. oh. Might there be a way through? Kind of. 
Yes, there was. Well, that was a successful little jaunt. <laughs> a passage, a a pass, a mountain pass, if you will. End up on the other side, straight in hail. <laughs> Wolfie? Ah, let's have you sit down there. Oh god! Oh god! Oh no. Well now I should have kept some of those uh flints. Hold on. This is the now <laughs> that that was a good like this is fine, chicken. <laughs> that that was pretty good. Alright, he's not going to go back there. Is that also lava over there? It is! We're surrounded by lava. Geologically active. Oh god. Alright, let's go to sleep before we watch this chicken burst into flames. Like, where's that flame coming from? All right, Wolfie, let's go. Ah, let's go this way. Let's not go that way. What are you doing? Ah! <laughs> Dang it! I'm trying to murder me. <laughs> trying to box us in, Wolfie. Serpentine, serpentine. I did walk right into him. I made eye contact. I guess I should make more beds too, huh? Huh? Well, that was exciting. <laughs> There are no Endermen in this game. Thankfully, could you imagine? I mean, they were about to be called Farlanders. before that new biome was called the end.
Yeah, why did we call them testificates? Was that like... Their name? Like in the code or something? Think I remember this stuff? <laughs> ah, it said testificate above their heads. I see. Look at this neat little situation here. Oh, and then it like <laughs> makes another U-turn and goes down here. Well, let's not. Let's maybe not go down there. Wookie cave. That would have been easier just to drop down the cactus by hand, but here we are. <laughs> but here we are. I'm going to need replacements of all my tools soon. Wolfie. Oh my god. He's still going after that one. Alright. These pigs are dry! Uh, oh. There we go, that's better. Ooh, let's go over there. I guess you can really still tell the jitter. At a distance. I mean, like, you could see the mountain moving separately from the cloud. But I guess when you're just walking face on, it doesn't appear so bad. Come out here. Oh, that's a shame. That's a shame. Hate to see it. Fourteen, fourteen, fourteen is not coming up. 
It's miles away. Literal minutes, even. <laughs> yeah, your stream lag is in the negatives. several days without rest if necessary. The cannot. Small batch knows. Thank you for the five subs in the tub. We will have no 14 14 14 here. Careful of eight. Did I eat that? <laughs> Possible. We'll never know. That's a heck of a chonker <laughs> right here, isn't it? This is, this is a, that's a big arch. I didn't think it connected. Can't. It's too big. I can't fit it in the frame. It's not as impressive looking from this angle. Neat. <laughs> Neat. That's a shame. Heard any good rumors lately? Not now, sorry. And also, not now, sorry. That that doesn't do text to speech. <laughs> That's that that is merely meant for applause.
found out there's a sequel to Tron coming out. A third. I was gonna say there already was. A third Tron. Well, our friend Dan Lassac did the music for the most recent Tron video game. Triton. <laughs> Tritron? Tritron. There was a Tron video game? Yes! It's like a... It's a... Uh, what's his name? Mike Bithel? Bithdel? I don't know his name. But it's like a... Choose your own adventure kind of... Story game. Not necessarily like an action game or anything like that. It came out like two years ago or something like that. A year or two ago. Now whenever I see smooth stone, I'm like, lava! Are there any good movies lately? Dune Part 2. But that's like only in the theaters at the moment. I guess that did come out, didn't it? Spotlight. I don't think so. Well, then turn it on so he can see. Ah, <laughs> uh, get it? The spotlight? <laughs> Jokes! Oh. Oh, that's an old movie. Yeah, I saw that. Wise Mountain Man? What gives it away? Is it the red plaid shirt? The giant beard? The overall gruff and cynical disposition? <laughs> Shopping at farm stores. 
for a free bucket. <laughs> That's my retirement bucket! Ah. Have you seen Killers of the Flower Moon? No, I guess we haven't seen that one yet. I know the girlfriend wanted to see it. But it's like, very long. <laughs> Where? I don't even know... It's probably not streaming anywhere. Or you probably have to like, rent it or whatever. Doink. Well, I have to do this. We. I have connected these two bodies of water. Whoa, Wolfie, you almost got diced. I have connected these three bodies of water. Apple TV. Well, don't have that. Oh, let's not forget Wolfie either. It's the three body problem. I solved it. <laughs> it's just bodies of water. I'm so smart. Oh, damn. Oh, no, Wolfie. Uh, uh, you're looking so majestic, and then you look away when I go to. T Stop it! Ha! Huh. Okay. <laughs> What about, uh, I mean, is it any good? I know a lot of people were risen on it <laughs> because of how stupidly long it is. Nobody knows. Nobody's seen it, apparently. This bar chart plots the growth of cactus. No, not three body problem, killers of the flower moon. Did Akko not see it? You're the one who asked. <laughs> oh. 
Like pulling teeth with chat today. You're all perky and talkative when the girlfriend is here. You leave your old boy Kurt J. Mac hanging. How about little? Wait, what is it called? Poor, poor little things. Poor things. What is the name of that movie? How about that one? Anybody seen that one? Oh, no, no. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, I know it won awards. But also, yes, the the themes seem a bit rough, <laughs> to say the least. Colors of the Flower Moon is three hours and 26 minutes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for that information. I wasn't quite asking, but I appreciate the, the data. Crazy stupid love if you want a funny romance. I don't think... Isn't that an old movie too? Isn't that the one with Ryan Gosling? I mean, oh, I guess it's got what's-her-name-in-it who was in... The other movie we were just talking about. Emma Stone. She's in La La Land with Ryan Gosling. But also... In... <laughs> also in the, the crazy... Unless I'm thinking of a different movie. We did! See? I'm out here pulling teeth, trying to come up with things to talk about, and we missed 14, 14, 14. There's no way to bring it back, either. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Close! Let's see 14 hours, 14 minutes, and 14 seconds, Kurt Hong. Gotta get it a little bit more than that. Fourteen hours, fourteen minutes, and fourteen seconds. Gotta give it a little bit more of a scooch. The longer you wait, the harder it gets. That's for good. I said you may that. Experience the emptiness with there it is. Thanks. 
Cruel Peak. That's what it takes. Cruel Peak with those Bezos bucks. Thank you very much. Welcome to the sub tub. With a clean two minutes back on the timer. We missed 14, 15, 16. <laughs> but we're here for 14, 14, 14. Was it actually ever 14, 14, 14 if nobody was paying attention? Did it ever actually make a sound when it fell in the forest? Here it comes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I got a boat. Bunch of rap scallions, the whole lot of you. It's no seventeen, seventeen, seventeen. Don't forget, you can double the time with double mint gum. Sponsor. If we raise the full amount of the charity goal. Double time. Well, that boat. Is Thanks gone. for letting me sit in. Ain't nothing to it. Cheerio for TTS. Cheerio? Hi ho, cheerio. Spot a tea. I spot a tea in the morning. I forgot about my tea. That's the song I, I should learn to play on the trombone. It's only four notes. Bing, bing, bong, bong, bong. Five notes. <laughs> That's uh, good tidings. Timo Warner wants it again. Yay. <laughs> that one was better. <laughs> Bonk. That was gonna be a tree made hidey hole. Ah, Wolfie.
Oh, I've got plenty of wood. Too much, you could even say. <laughs> I never understood mushroom hot chocolate. They just dissolve. Marshmallow. <laughs> Marshmallow hot chocolate. Somebody's watching on mobile with autocorrect. That's why you gotta, you gotta, you gotta get them before they dissolve. Dried mushrooms mm. a delicacy. <laughs> oh, that is still the best video game moment ever. <laughs> yeah, I was trying to justify it. Like, maybe it's like vegan hot chocolate or something like that, but there's got to be a better way than mushrooms. Hmm. There's got to be a better way. Ooh, excuse me again. We'll all take anything at face value at this point. I wonder if all this gravel was up here and it fell down at some point. Hundreds of thousands of years ago. Geologically speaking. True, in geological time, 100,000 years isn't that much. A waterfall. It is a waterfall.
I think it would have been better if it went into an actual pool of water. Myself. My own opinion. Mushroom hot chocolate falls. <laughs> uh. Mushroom hot chocolate does exist. They do exist. Mushroom, mushroom. Chocolate, 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 mushroom, mushroom. What the heck, Wolfie? Put it on throne. <laughs> Listen. Hard enough convincing the girlfriend eat beans. Mushrooms are another story. Although we did try, I did buy a portabella. We tried a bite. <laughs> she says for her the flavor is fine because I like loaded it up with garlic and stuff. It's the texture. The texture of the mushroom. About the cone. <laughs> so, oh, I'm out of beds. I'm out of beds. A hot tub. <laughs> Come on, Wolfie, get away from the water. Ah! Uh, uh. Well, the pickaxe lasts for me to finish this hidey hole. Yes! Yes, it will. Then most certainly I will probably forget to craft a new one before leaving tomorrow. That's that's the next guy's problem. All right, this guy's problem is he's gonna sleep and then back up the world and call it a day. Where we at? Where we at? Oh, fifty-nine thousand nine hundred and thirteen point two megabytes. You know what that means? If we add about 70 megabytes per run, the next run, the next segment, will get us damn close. Damn close to 60,000 megabytes.
I'll sip my tea to that. 